It happens to us all. You're on the road, behind the wheel, and hear the familiar tones of text, email, and website alerts. What do you do? Text back? According to the National Safety Council, more than 100,000 crashes a year involve drivers who are texting. Today, students, faculty, and staff join local elected officials in the Hall of Governors to take the pledge at the AT&T sponsored It Can Wait campaign against texting while driving. So everyone's texting, everyone's surfing the web on their phone, everyone's placing phone calls in the car. Um, and you know what, it, it can wait. And the start now at the university level is extremely important so that they can teach the future generations not to text while driving. The simulator at the event shows drivers firsthand the dangers of texting while driving. Once you've experienced these life-altering scenarios, you take the pledge to never do so on the real road. Texting while driving is very dangerous and um, spreading the word. Uh, we like to make this pretty much like the seat belt. When they first came out with seat belts, people didn't want to wear seat belts, but now it becomes natural. And we want this to campaign to, to be the same way. The event was hosted by the Student Healthcare Management Association to encourage the GSU community to take the pledge to become safer drivers. And this is driven exclusively by our Student Healthcare Management Association. They, they took it on, they did all the work behind it, and they made it happen. And I'm so proud of them. If you missed the opportunity to take the pledge, say these words. No text message, email, website, or video is worth the risk of endangering my life or the lives of others on the road. I pledge to never text and drive and will take action to educate others about the dangers of texting while driving. Remember, whatever the message, it can wait. No text is worth the risk. I'm your TWAG host, Nikki Daly, and I pledge not to text and drive. TWAGged.